Hello, happy Wednesday. Hey, Cable, Palfly, Sayori, welcome. You have my my stream on your tablet and Doug's stream on your laptop. Nice. Yeah, I forgot Doug streams at the same time, huh? Wednesdays are always a bit slow streaming wise. But I'm glad to have the people who do decide to join. Oh, I need to announce the stream. All right, well, let's just do some instant wordles so people people join in. Let's see. F and W. Do we need instant fibble? <laughs> Wonder what that would be like. Swift. Okay. Let's see. G and W. Gwift. <laughs> no. Um. Ghoul. <laughs> um, this is this one's weird. What is this? What? Um, Wowga. Oh, it doesn't start with W. Oh, a glow. Nice. Good job, Martin. Oh, Sari got it. I didn't see that. So how do I, how am I missing one chat in in three? Um, Trist. Pretty sure. All right. Let's do one more, then we'll move on. D and M. Madam. No, can't be. Can't end an M. Well, I'm out of ideas. It's like Maddie a word? Oh, Madly's a word. That's for sure. Yep. Madly's not a terrible start for Squirtle. All right, there is a Y. Interesting, but it's not the end of this word. There's a Y in the middle of this word. Um, hmm. Maybe we should do a word that starts with L and ends with Y to see if we can locate them. So like, oh yeah, kayak. Interesting. Um, lousy is pretty good. Let's do that. Okay, we found the Y. So if we're thinking this is kayak, then the S goes here. I think I'll just guess kayak. I don't think there's another word that's K-A-A-K, -A -A -K, right? Karak. Kafak. No. Nice, it is kayak. Okay. So we have an S, we have an L somewhere. It's not an A. I think, yeah, L second would make sense. Yeah, it actually, L's probably pretty much forced to be second because we're not ending an S, L. Double S makes sense. Bliss? Could be. Could also be bless, right? Let's get the E instead. Oh, flesh? Hmm. I like starting with S better, though. Oh, wow. 
<laughs> Ever doing well. Um, we've got like no info about these though. Stick, maybe. Epoxy. Okay, so if that were true, what would this be? Oh no, O. Oh, true, not epoxy. Ebony? No, there's no O. Um, oh, there is an O, so stock might make sense, yeah. Empty. There's no M in the puzzle. Hmm. Entry. I think entry works. Um... What starts with B and ends with K? No L. Maybe BR? We could do brick, and we could do intro. I think this is it. So let's, let's try intro. That would be hilarious to get all three columns first. Oh my gosh, it finished both. I forgot it would do that. Wait. Did we just get an eight? No, we didn't. Oh no! Oh, that's a shame. Uh, it's not Brick. Uh, it could be Brink. And then Stork. Seven. Oh. Seven is still really good. Top ten saddest anime endings. <laughs> oh, it wasn't stock. Still really good. Yeah. Kayak was super lucky. I don't know how you came up with that. All we knew was there was a Y somewhere. <laughs> and it wasn't start or end. And you're like, it's clearly Kayak. Um, okay. Let's do Dortle. Oh, we have to vote first. All right, I gotta include Kayak. Here, we'll, we'll include Bless intro and kayak and then we're gonna include stork okay okay now my chat's just frozen uh, i'll refresh did the poll go through do you guys have a poll because i don't i don't see it All right, I'll try again. All right, it was bless, intro, kayak, and stork. Please work. Okay, good, it worked. I was worried we wouldn't have polls today. Kayak was more, <laughs> more likely than kayak with cues. Definitely true. <clears throat> Yeah, stock told us brink versus brick, so that was good. I think if it had been stock, we would have done brick and still gotten a seven. Double check the K for good measure. Yeah. All right. Yeah, our viewership's a little low, so we get six votes. That's okay. I love you guys. The polls are super slow today, but it's intro kayak. Whoa, well that was helpful. Natal? Uh, R-O-N-A or something? Ronin? No. Sonar. Well, that was easy. Are you, are you guys here? I don't know if my chat's broken. I'm going to refresh my chat again. Oh, I can't end the poll. Oh, did I did I get it? Someone say something. All right, I see hunting spirits say nice and cable say it's broken. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to avoid polls 
because they seem to be messing up my chat. Um, so we'll do informal polls instead. Yeah, chat is not doing well, which is not good. Hey, Martin. All right, well, we'll, we'll do our best with what we've got. Sonar Natal. YouTube really needs to do something about their awful chat. Uh, I don't know, Randy? Nope. <laughs> it was worth a try. Um, Range, ranch, yeah. Hey, Daily Gab, how you doing? Um, I'm gonna guess chess. Okay, well, that got me ranch. Doing well, that's good. Um, Where's this? Is it, we got an OER word, so we better start working on that one. We need a really, really good filler for all the OER words that are left. Um, we got power, poker. Um, Joker, boxer, mower. I don't know if we're going to be able to get all the OER. We'll have to get lucky. But is there a word that uses P, K, B, and W? I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, we may be able to get the other words first, which might... Yeah, if, adapt will get us the T. Sorry, the P. No! Now we don't get a filler at all. Oh no. Oh. Oh, there wasn't two A's. Well, it's audit, I think. Um, what's this bottom right word? Okay, there's a P, so it's power or poker. This is going to come down to luck. It, we have to be able to... Okay, so the luck is we need this word, and we need to hope either that this word has a W or K in it, or we need to get this word and then win a 50-50. Double E? Where are you thinking the second E is? I, I can see... I mean, maybe it's like geese. All right, let's go for geese. Wow, it is geese. Um, we managed to avoid the one place E goes in the top left. Uh, all right, well, poker or power? It's 50-50. Put it in chat. I, don't, I can't poll right now, so put in chat what you want. Informal poll. We got one vote for power. I don't think Moper's a thing. Let's do power or poker. It accepts it, but like, it's not, not really a thing. Okay, everyone wants power, so we're gonna do that. Nice. Hey, everyone was right. No one wanted poker. And I was doomsaying the whole time. All right, uh, I think I'm just going to pick for this one since we can't. Let's do power power audit. Gets all the vowels. It's actually a decent start, isn't it? Whoops, I pressed space instead of enter. Power audit. Whoa. Rooter? Is there anything else? You called it from the start? You did. You did. Windy. Windy's pretty good. Nice.
I don't know what Mooter is. I think it's just Rooter. It is. Oh, Onic Trap? Sonic, Conic, Ionic, Monic. Oh, no, it's not. You're right. There's no N there. Okay. Trap avoided. What the heck? Is this Peony? No, there's no Y. Peons? I don't know. Oh, phone. That makes sense. Uh, a little bit more mundane than I was thinking. This could be Spoke. This could be other things, probably. Greet. Slope, yep. Strike greet. Nice. There's a Y. Oh, what's this one? Uh, N. G. Clearly. Oh, kayak again? Oh, yeah, it must be. Word of the day. I only said it must be because that would make it the word of the day, not because I thought it was the only option. <laughs> but it turned out it was true. Um, what's going on here? Something G, something A, N? Oh, vegan. Figured it out. Going. And not spoke. Kayak fixed that, so it's probably slope. <sighs> Scope. Darn. Almost perfect game. Oh, elope as well, huh? True. No, it couldn't have been. Not double E. All right. Uh, all right. Well, we are going to do a rescue. D R something P E? That doesn't seem like a word. Like droop? <laughs> Apparently, droop is a word, but I don't think so. Um, prude, I think, is the word. Can't be pride. I'm going to go with prude. Yes. Uh, what else do we have here? Ooh. C R. Something, something, D? Crowd. V, A, valet, no? Yes. There is a T. Nacho? Oh, apparently not nacho. Oops. Oops. Bacon. We have a bacon nacho. Um, I think it's like E. No, the L doesn't go there. Uh, oh, E A L T. Oh, least would work. Yeah. So it isn't felt a word though. Apparently not. Yeah, it's just felt. Delt is a word, but there's no D. I guess there's no E-A-L-T word. All right, well, we'll go with least then. Can't be leapt. Nice. We got to be careful because we, we lost our uh, filler to a mistake. Um, above is given. I think someone said that earlier. And something. Definitely something. Starts with E. And then D-I. That's all forced. Edify, that's a word. Yep. 
Yes, it was edify. All right, put three of these words in chat. I'll pick my favorite. All right, what do I like best? Above edify crowd, edify bacon crowd, limbo prude bacon, edify above prude. Hmm. I think I like edify bacon crowd. It I don't know why it sounds like we're like feeding a crowd bacon or something. <laughs> Oof. Okay. Okay, here we go. F, wait. I already said polls aren't working. They're like crashing my chat. Um, oh, but there's two spellings of fiber, and I think it can accept both. What is this? Urine, nice. And now it's fiber. It's spelled the American way. All right. Um, decor given. Whose or whom? No, not whom. Whom doesn't have an E at the end. Whole. Hmm. F R O. Frost seems like a good guess, but so is froth. Okay. Non-terminal Y. It's clearly kayak. Um, limbo again? Where? Oh, here? Nice. What, what has R, U, and Y in it? Just U. Okay, on the right we've got attic. Good to get the T. Um, there is a T, but it still could be frost or froth. I'm gonna come back to that. I have no idea. A E R. Wonderful. There's a T. Taker. So we've taser, taker, taper, and we've got hater. Gator. Probably not gator. Not doing that one. Um, it's not baddie. So what is it? Oh, it is baddie. Never mind. There are two T's. Uh, chick. Yes. Now we can go back up. Uh, I think it has to be frost now because there's no H. All right, back to the top. Um, visit? No, there's no I second. Hold on. We're... 
Oh, split. Yeah. Good. L E A S E. Lease. Okay. Uh, this is vivid. This is bilge. Bilge comes up a lot, and I never remember what it means. This is whole. Uh, okay. S Y. So syrup. Syrup. Skill. Pairer? No. Oh, the R wasn't in the middle. I thought there were two R's. Why did I think there were two R's? It's taper. Oh, no. Okay, well, we still had room. I saw... Yeah. I saw something weird there. I don't think I, I, don't think I was zoomed out enough to see all the letters. Okay. I knew it had a T, too. I, was, I went through all the options earlier. Just forgot. Um, let's do setup order. Give me your give me your three word starts. I'll pick one. Again, we can't vote today because the voting system seems to be broken. You don't have to use the previous words, just any three words start. Hey, James. Doubt nymphorize. Worst words start. A rose pinky clump. That is pretty bad. Worst word start is pretty bad. I don't know if it's the worst, but it's bad. Um, I'll use yours, Rithic. Let's go with a rose, pinky, and clump. Uh, yikes. It doesn't hit the T, which is unfortunate. Welch. Like the... Nope. Leech. Welch's is like a juice, juice brand, isn't it? Fruit juice brand. Skate. Depth. And canal. I was like, what vowel goes there? Ah, the, the only one that can. P A pair. Azure. A, a veil. Giddy. Nope. Biddy? Oh, it could be Diddy as well. Diddy. <sighs> Never lucky. Um, taboo. Murky. Bend, patch, amble, smote. I have to make it so small. SK skirt. Oh, and then my goof up made it so we couldn't do the last word, which was prose. Oh, well. 
Yikes. Some tough words right at the start. It was mostly this one though, the itty trap. And it couldn't have even been Diddy. Okay, uh, let's do pros for Gauntlittle. I don't know why that happens. There we go. Pros. Hmm. Mouth's a good one. Ooh, couch, cough. Does Doug play in ultra hard mode? Because if not, he really needs to. Um, scone. Well, uh. Ascot, that's fun. Nice. I don't know why, I want to do parry. Okay, well that was a bad idea. Um, badge, that's, oh. Badge would have been good instead of parry. Still actually good. Um, what do we have here? Blade. Clearly kayak. What else would it be? All right. Um, snare. Oops. Well, that's not how you spell snare. And that also doesn't put a fourth. That was very bad. Um, we had sonar earlier. We could do that. Oh, I like scrap. That's nice. Strap. Six paths to victory. Well, that's an O and that's a T. Then we have an S. Is it oost? Oh, oist would work too. So we got moist. Foist. We have boost. And what else? Oh, we have joist. Okay, so we've got moist, joist, boost, and foist. Jumbo works great. It's moist. Nice. Filmy Fjord. Oh, whenever Fjord's possible, we should use it. Uh, Jiffy, Jumbo, Mafia, and Motif. Lots of options today. Yeah, nothing really, nothing really like difficult about that one. Just find a word that uses three letters. <laughs> okay, let's do Gram Jam. Osboya. We have a J and a Z. Can we do Jazzy? Hey, Dondre, how you doing? What do you want me to say? Oh, pillow is good. There go. Unfortunately, Jazzy uses two Zs. Is raisin a word? R A S S E N? I don't think it is. Say what, DeAndre? Um. Oh, coffee? Can I do coffee? 
Wait, that's not how you spell coffee. It has another E at the end. Hmm. Could have earlier. Oops. I could do, is fauna pluralized with an S? Could I do faunas? Reens is a word. That's two swaps. I think fauna is like already plural, right? Like, I don't know. Fauna. That worked. Very nice. Now we really need to do a horizontal word, I think. Um, rays. We need to start thinking about this J and Z. I'm almost tempted to do J's instead, but... Bozo. Ooh. Two swaps, though. I don't know. I don't know what's accepted in this game. <laughs> Let's do rays and go from there. We've got two names we can do. We've got Joanna and we've got Jeff. <laughs> Except there's no um there's no N. Seam is possible for sure. The question is, do we want to use two E's right now? I don't think we do. Cosmo with two? Hmm. Can we not get the J or Z? I'm tempted to do Bozo. Be better not to use two vowels, though. Jobs with two. Hmm. Like here. Try cough. Or jerk. There's no K. Am I blind? No, I don't see. It. I don't see a K. Okay, cough is a word. So it was Abby apparently. Okay. Well, that's it. <laughs> Better luck next time. Still three stars somehow, even though the Z lost us three swaps. All right, let's do phrasal. A two-word phrase. It probably starts with the, right? Hey, DeAndre, please don't spam. The mother, that's a lot of THEs. Um, the brains, I say that all the time. Hmm. Hat, hot, hot, tamale, how do you spell that, <laughs> hot mother, hot potato. That's what it was. Nice, Cable. Ah, yes, that is how you spell tamale, now that I see it. All right, let's keep going. Um, STS seems reasonable. 
But then what goes before a T? I guess a vowel? Finally got a phrase all nice. Ooh, excuse me. I don't know what goes before this T. Atheists. Nice. It wasn't the answer, but it worked. So the S is not repeated. Oops. Um, could be something like that. Oh no, the S is not repeated. Interesting. R E R could be. Um, or E R E. I don't know. I'm going to go back to RER and see if that does anything. I can do SE in that case. Seems hard though. No, I don't see it. Thought resounded, but that's too many letters. Resunded? <laughs> re, re. I don't know. Do you have a question? You'd be the one who'd know, not me. Um. What if I do something like this? Ugh. None of this looks good. I'm gonna have to do a filler. Oh, secluded? That works. Ooh, close. Seconded. Very nice. How many options were there? 18. Apparently we weren't geniuses. DED, it was definitely the way to go. Look at all the DED words. There were a few SES words that we got. SIS as well. And atheists was the only STS in the common words. Interesting. Stigmata, yeah. I keep wanting to do the mini, but there's no mini unlimited. Uh, this could be spore. Um, ropes, yeah. Oops, ropes. Pros. Pores. Oh no, there's so many. Um... What if I do like order and hope for the best? Nice. Okay, R is taken care of. I do another O E word. Repos could be. 
I could do like other, but I'd like to get the P or the S involved. Uh, maybe I'll end in S and hope that doesn't end in S. Yeah, R is not second. So it probably ends in O R E. Yeah, spore is probably the 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 answer. So Yeah. Can I do posse? No, we can't end an E. Opines. Opine. Can't end an E. We could do opens. I think that's good. Oh, P is second. Oh, I forgot. Um, that's okay. So it is definitely spore. Um, so like an APPS word. Can't start with S. Props. No, we can't put the O in the middle. Caps. Not a word. Maps. Laps. Taps. I don't know. Even paps would work. Popes. I think that works. Nice. And it was Spore. All right. Let's do Word 500. Spore. Angel? Why not? Oh. Um, I'm guessing we got the E placed. Or not necessarily placed, but that the E is correct. Um, this is my guess, but it could be way off. We could find something like this, like fecal or something. Okay, so I was wrong. Uh, so if there's an L, it's yellow. What if the E and A are correct? I'm thinking... Maybe not. So what goes before that N? Okay, yeah, maybe this E's in the right spot. Does gated work? I think gated works, yeah. One green and gated. Okay, my assumptions are very wrong. But I do think that this happened. So no A's, no G. We have to have an N and an L. Um, Lumen does work. Three greens in Lumen. So I think we placed the E, the N, and the L. Could just be linen. Liven? Oh no. Lichen? Yes.
Okay, got it. That trap. All right, let's do selectal. We'll start with lichen. Oh, wow, there's an L, I, and N. What about lingo? Um, I'm going to do... Oh, wait, I can't do K or G at the end of the N. Or E. How about flint? And I'm going to do shift here. I'm going to do yellows. Okay, so the L's in place for sure. The I and N are not. Why are we using the same word? We play the games together too often. Um, I do like slain. I think slain's a good idea. And we'll use yellow again. Oh, it was just the answer. <laughs> nice. Good solve. Let's do proximal and we'll start with slain. Nothing. Okay. So I want to do greed. I think a T would work well. Really, any of them would be fine, but T is common, so T H would be good. Can I do think? I can. Okay, F or Y? Probably an F. And then what's this last letter going to be? I, O, or L? Let's send an L. Fatal? Nice. All right. Let's do Zordal. Uh, oh, we found a nightmare puzzle. Let's just check if we're in a trap because it's a nightmare. We are. Um, so Wait, what are the what are the options for itch? Witch, ditch, probably not the B word. Hitch. Okay, so it's howdy. Howdy is the itch trap. I kept forgetting what howdy was for. Um, okay, so it's got to be hitch as one word, and then we've got. The O placed and there's a D somewhere. D O, I guess. Oh, Gord is not bad. Dorks. <laughs> R-O-D? Rodeo? No. Oh, donor? Oh, there's an N. I missed that there was an N. Yeah. Hitch donor. Hey, we destroyed that, but only because the nightmare made me think, ah, it's probably a trap, and I went for itch right away. <laughs> a little meta there. I'll take it though. I should have done pinch because we knew that there was a T there and that would have actually gotten me the end super early. Oh well. Let's do peaks and we'll start with donor. Yeah, it's basically the top, I think top 100 puzzles that people in unlimited fail. Like it tracks that. Shock. Yeah, that's fine. Is 
Is there an arid word? <laughs> Tepid works. No, it doesn't. Yeah. This can't be an I. Rapid works, yes. Oof. Um. I was thinking about GH, but wouldn't this have to be a vowel? I don't think RGH works. We could do RGE. Got it. All right. Warmel time. Okay, I want to use an M or a G here. Probably G will work. G E R. Um, what can I do? Um, wager. It is a G. Um, what? Gotta be H, right? Oh, it could be double G. You're right. Oh, G-H-T, yes, for sure. So like knight, might, or like, wow, that still didn't narrow it down. Uh, let's make a mighty guess. Okay. Knight trap, how many traps are we going to get? All right, let's do the super. Nothing. Um, what trap are we going to get this time? The, uh, um... What trap do we want to do? You want crumb? That's funny. Nothing. Um, ooh, there's the there's the um the Oli trap. Oh, I can't do Oli trap. We're illy. All right. We can do an AER trap, but we can't do later. We could do logger. Finally, something. Um, let's end in T. E A T maybe. It's like. I don't know if that works. Oh, wheat? Does that work? Nice. Good job. Good, good call. Ugh, okay. So this is H or I. Ist, maybe? Wow, we're down to very few letters here. Heist? It is Ist. Uh, exist. No. Oh, hold on. T or Z? Twist. What a twist. Oof. <laughs> we were down to so few letters for these guesses. That's crazy. Now we do the plus and we hope for the best. Um, darn, I can't do sus us. Draw works, yes. Okay, there's an A here, of all things. Um, we had canal earlier, right? All right, A, M, I guess? I don't know. I don't know if I like M or K better. 
Is it kayak? No, there's no A here. Should've done kayak. Um, what does this? Maybe this is an R. I like Gleam. Whoa, I really like Gleam. Good job, Chris Person. Yes. Good solve. Actually, that was our best solve of the three. <laughs> Very nice. Gleam and glean are two different words. Gleam is like when it's shiny, like the sunlight gleams off of a shiny surface. And glean is when you um, intuit an answer, I think. I don't know if that's the best definition for that, but. Get info, yeah. Gleam. There's an E, but it's not first, not surprising. Um, how about pride? There's an E second, and there's a D somewhere. Um, decoy is good. There's an E third. Okay, so we're like needy. Oh. What else is there? CD. There we go. Nice. It's still confusing where the greens end up. <laughs> you just have to twist it in your mind. I mean, you can kind of see the green spelled out E E D Y. So. Shouldn't be that confusing, but it still is. All right, let's do symbol. So with blade, no, not. We'll start with CD. Ooh, okay. I think there's a Y at the end, and we probably end in either EY or SY. What do I even like better? It can't be double SY. If it was double SY, then these this green would be here. I'm thinking EY maybe. You know, DE, yeah, DE could work. Let's go with blades. <laughs> no, well, we have to go with blade if we're going to do that. All right. All right, yeah, it's, uh, what, LDE? What does that? Wait, what if it just ends in ED? Um, A, E, D. No, that doesn't work. Tilda. Wow, good job. Nice three. Is that the only word that ends in LDE? It might be. Let's do one more. And we're starting with tilde, apparently. Uh, maybe the L-E are in place? We can try that. Yeah, tilde's the, the button when you hold shift and press the button next to the one. It's the, it's this, this thing. That's a, that's a tilde. Oh, false, yes. Oh, interesting result. So we've got definitely an E here, definitely an S here, maybe a T here. Um, chest is perfectly fine, but not correct. Um, quest, good one. Nice. Very nice.
Okay, let's keep moving. Spare. All right, let's 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 try a hard mode solve if we can. I, I kind of want to fibble like the enforces hard mode. That would be nice. Um... We could do something like, um, A R E. Like carve. Interesting result. So we know there's an A in the word. We know there's an R in the word because these E's don't match up. Um, maybe R A and then an E here. Oh, we could be an we could be an A E R word for sure. And there's just no V, which means that there has to be a P or an. Oh no, yeah, never mind. The E. So the E would be the lie here. Let's mark it, and then the V would be the lie here. Something like taker, yeah. Um. Or just water. Okay, so this is the lie. So it's W A something E R. Waxer? Nope. W A Wainer? Nope. Wader? Wafer. Darn, trappy. All right, my spell fly. Is waker a word? If so, it's even more trappy. The problem with AER is even if you have four of the letters, it's still a trap. Who knew about the WAER trap? Yeah, just AER in general is just nasty. Wager was definitely left, true. He even guessed that earlier, I think. Maybe I should have done a filler. Fillers are hard and fibble, but they're not impossible all right let's do fusel um ooh, what are we going to start with we can't do whatever that was um eager's fun let's try that oh wow so it has to i think the e's at the end um what something like this ooh Algae. No. What? Began? Oh, it's vegan again. No, it's not. Oh, it doesn't even end in N. Oh, somehow I missed that we actually learned it didn't end with N. Oops. Uh, oh, it's probably begat, but we can't guess that. Um, okay. Oops. I should have done begat here, but I messed up. Let's do a blind one. Oh, good. We get the G and the T. Oh, at least it ends in T. All right, S T R E L. Well, that's helpful. Oh, I didn't need the T. What did I do the T for? Um, I'm not paying attention. Fleet. <laughs> okay. Clearly, fleet was the only possible answer. No attention works, I guess. True. Just, just. I mean, if you just type the answer, then uh, you don't have to pay attention. All right. L could be lying. E could be lying. T could be lying. That's unfortunate. But at least there's only one E. We know that. In fact, I think with double letters, 
The second one will point to the other word. It's kind of weird. So I think there's no E in this word. So let's not use E anymore. Um, let's do troll. All right, let's do all new letters. Pinch. All right, the C is true, the H might be lying, the N is true. Knack. N is true, C is true, K is true. Snuck. Yes. I think double letters are key. I think I think that's the strategy. Double letters is the strategy in this game. Because I do think they give away what's going on. That's something we're going to have to try more of to see if that's actually true. All right. Let's do Foxy Max. Uh, spam the letters you want, and I'm just going to look over and see what seems to be spammed a lot. All right. E is wrong. I see an O. We want an A. That sounds good. I, I refuse to guess bad letters, James. Um, R. Unless there's a reason for them. Uh, S is good. There's plurals in these in this game. L. Okay. Oh, no L. H T. I think I like T here. Oh, maybe I should gone with H. Should have gone with H. Shows. It's not shows. Oh, there's something else. N? Sure. Oh, no N. Now there's a lot of N's. I think we need a Y. P. Yes, shops. Good. Parks? Not parks. Uh, yeah, we should probably get the vowels. Oh, Paris? Paris is a city. Um, you? Dingy. No. Vigil. M? Comic, maybe, yeah. Mincy, whatever that means. It's not gamma, what is that? Feels probably, right? Yes, and is gamba a word? We already guessed F. It's either gamka, gamda, gamja, gamza, gamxa, or gamba. Playing for gambling. Interesting. Let's click it and see what this says. It's an instrument similar to the cello. Interesting. <sighs> but yes, short for gambling would be appropriate. Uh, I don't know what country this is. Ultimate change says it's Honduras with confidence. Okay. What countries border Honduras? Um, El Salvador. Guatemala and Nicaragua. Good job. Can I guess the capital city of Honduras? No, but I bet ultimate change can. Honduras city. No. Um, I have no idea. 
I don't know if I've ever even learned the capital of Honduras ever in my life. You forgot the capital? That's okay. Um, it looks like it lists every city in the world or something. Or is this just every capital in the world? I wonder how it populates this list. Should I just fail it? Oh, wow. Tegu blah, blah, blah. Tegu Kigalpa. Anyone know the flag? None of these look familiar to me. Fourth one. Nice. Population of Honduras. Probably less than 2 million. Oh, it's 8 to 12 million? Really? Uh, I'm guessing they use the dollar. The Lempira. Okay. Well, the two times I guessed, I was very wrong, so maybe I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Let's do where taken. Ooh. Pretty. So colorful. I have no idea where we are, though, so I'm just going to guess... See, Taika wants Bolivia. Let's start with that. Ooh, that's close. Northwest of Bolivia. 1,400 kilometers. Peru? Peru is bordering Bolivia, though, right? That's pretty far. How about Colombia? Oh, south of Colombia. Maybe Peru was right? Peru was right? Okay, so how is that? The way it measures is weird. It should say borders, right? Center to center. That makes it so much harder. What landmarks in Peru? That one. It looked very Peru to me. What's it called? Red Square, obviously. I think Seven Colored Earths is probably what the last picture we saw was called. That's Machu Picchu. Makes sense. Capital of Peru. Is it Limon? Oh, it's Lima. I was close. I was going to say Limon. What's Limon the capital of? What city was this taken in? Lima. No? Well, I'm out of ideas. Cusco? The poison for Cusco? Cusco's poison? I'm going to pick Cusco for the memes unless someone says speaks up. Ah, it was er Eric Ericuipa. So what is this? View on Wikipedia. I want to learn about this. Vinicuna or Vinicunca, also called Montaña de Siete Colores, Mountain of Seven Colors. Mountain of Colors or Rainbow Mountain is a mountain in the Andes of Peru with an altitude of 5,200 meters above sea level. Wow, that's very tall. That one's in Cusco. Very cool. So pretty. Wow. Look at that picture. Oh, alpaca. I love it. Okay. Now we do world ol. Oh, wait, wasn't there a where taken for US that we're supposed to do? Yeah, this one, right? Um... It was taken in 2013, I can tell you that. Is this a university or something? It feels university e to me. I don't know, maybe we're in like Boston then. No, uh, that would be Massachusetts. Nope. 
Close. New Hampshire. <laughs> About the same distance. In the same direction. Vermont. I don't think I'm going far enough. New York. Still not going far enough. Pennsylvania. Border, see this says borders. Borders Pennsylvania to the west, so Ohio. There we go. Whew. Ohio. Buckeye State. Haven't we had Ohio before? Oh, that's funny. Because Ohio means hello in um in Japanese. Uh, I think this is the purple lilac or the California poppy. Definitely not the scarlet carnation. High temperature in Ohio. It gets hot, right? Apparently not. Wait. Oh, October. I misread. I misread that. <laughs> Oops. I was thinking in the summer. I, I didn't read the rest of the sentence. Um, I'm clearly paying very much attention to these games right now. Um, I don't know. Probably not that one. Hey, I got it. It's Disney World. I think it's the Idaho Penitentiary. None of these say waterfall. Okay, Cuyahoga Valley. What's the capital of Ohio? The witch house at Salem, duh. Yes. Capital city of Ohio. Columbus. It's third in the song I sing. <laughs> middle. Hey, middle meta worked. Uh, capital meta. Nope. Cincinnati. Oh, it's Dayton, apparently. All right, now we can do Worldle. Oh. Uh, okay. Interesting. Very green. What are they growing? Oh, I can't continue that way, but I want to. That's cool over there. Very, very triangular. Guess we're going this way. What are these power lines? I'm so lost. There's like a modern bridge over here too. Oh, we're in Asia somewhere. Japan might make sense. Unfortunately, we have to actually locate where we are in Japan. Let me see the plates on. Yeah, this is a very Japan truck. I don't know if the plates are right. Okay, we've got that too. That's Japan. Okay. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to read anything. You think it's on an island? <laughs> you think Japan's on an island? I don't know. Do you mean like one of the smaller ones? I mean, I, I'm just got to click somewhere and see what the circle does. <clears throat> I could have clicked Obama. It would have been closer than what I clicked. I'm going to click the middle of this circle and get a smaller circle. Okay, well, maybe it's this national park. What do you think? Nope. 
Maybe it's this Eco Institute. No. Oh, sir. Where are the triangles? Oh, there is a bridge. Is that the bridge? Is that the bridge? Is that the bridge? It's called worldoldaily.com. There's a link in the description to all the games I play. I want to look at this bridge again. What's it actually bridging over? It's not bridging over water. It's bridging over this road. Is it bridging over water? There's like two bridges that cross. Ooh, what is that? Is that? Okay, there's like a tunnel. So it's got to be here, right? And then we're like on this road or something? I'm a little bit confused. Oh, these houses. This has to be it. But how far along are we? So we're right by this sort of first house. Oh, no, apparently not. Oh, maybe it's this first house. There we go. Shirikawa, Japan. Small city. Picturesque mountainous region. Historical village. It's a UNESCO World Heritage Site for its Gasho Zukuri houses, which are characterized by steep thatched roofs. And sturdy, yeah, they're triangles. Cool. Game lost. What? But I got it. Wait, where was the... Oh, it was this house. Close enough. I clicked here and here. Come on. <laughs> All right, we are going to try to get 20k on 2069, and maybe maybe we'll get more than 2k on one of these. Surely today will be the day we get lucky. I mean, skilled enough. <clears throat> Bikes. Clearly it's the Netherlands. Sun is south if you believe the compass. Uh, we can 5k this, right? Well, from the dirt, I can tell we're on Earth. Is this just us? Oh, just US? Netherlands with mountains? Yeah. I have no idea. We could be anywhere on Earth. I mean, anywhere arid. Uh... Nope, it was Jordan. Israel would have been a, a pretty decent guess. Should have gone with that. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Jordan again. <laughs> Same place. Near. EU, maybe? I kind of see some blue there, but not there. We have solar panels. Yeah, probably not Jordan for this one. There's a horse. Horse land. Where all the horses come from.
this power line is concrete. I am going to go Hungary. Close, Romania. One day I'll recognize the difference between Hungary and Romania concrete uh, poles, but not today. There's a little water ditch here. Some sort of canal or I don't know. I don't know what to call that. River? Man-made river? Did we have this one? We might have. I don't remember where it was if we did. That's probably something we should do is like remember where these are so that when we get them again, we know what they are. That would be cool. Uh, I'm completely like blank on this. If only we could read that. It just looks like, yes, there's text there maybe, but it could just be holes. But it seems like there's text. Hmm. Concrete road. Oh, shoe meta. Shoe meta. What do we got? Bona? Dona? Sona? I think it says Bona. Vanta Black is who took the photo. No more feet meta? What do the houses look like? So we probably get snow here because they do triangular roofs. The trees are interesting too. I don't think we're in Southeast Asia. I don't know. I have to guess somewhere and it's not going to be correct. Sure, let's guess China. It was Kyrgyzstan, obviously. Okay, we just have to get um, a little over 11,000 points on this one. Ooh, what flag is that? Yellow and white? That must be regional. <sighs> Tropical? Vatican, yes, we're in the Vatican, clearly. <clears throat> we have a transformer on the electricity pole. I'm gonna go um I'm gonna go El Salvador. Hey on films, how you doing? Hey, that wasn't bad. Nicaragua. I was actually thinking about Nicaragua as well. But then I went El Salvador last second. All right, 12K. Honestly, that's not as bad as I thought it would be. 13, almost 13K. Let's try another round. Oh my. Okay, I think that's Arabic. Yeah, any, oh, we have a red solo cup. No, that's, a, that's not a solo cup. That's just a red like fast food cup. So which Arabic country are we in? Could be any of them. I'm thinking like Iraq. Apparently it was Syria and we get, okay, 2,800. I keep seeing this zero and thinking that we get zero points. Syria, huh? Well, this is particularly difficult. This is the 2069 map, which has a bunch of photospheres, and it covers basically every country. All right. Um, I apologize, but I do need to take a quick break. Um, I'll leave this up for you guys.
All right, sorry about that. I'm back. Um, you guys got to stare at this horse for a while. I'm sure you know exactly where we are then. Did we have any guesses? You think Brazil, since the horse doesn't speak Spanish? You say Peru? Um, oh, they, they do this like double, like this is, is this concrete? And then they have a wooden pole attached. Costa Rica. Is that the same horse? I bet you that's the same horse. Moving around while they take the picture. Hey, that human, how you doing? Sorry I was on break when you got here. I needed a quick break. Um, all right, well, why don't we hedge a bit? So we've got Peru, we've got Costa Rica. Uh, Brazil. So I'm going to hedge with Colombia. Ah, yes. Good hedge. Good hedge. We were in Azerbaijan. Azerbaijan. I don't know how to, I don't know how to correctly pronounce that country. Azerbaijan. Uh, good, good. Ooh, look at that plate. Huh. This pole is blue and white painted. Has the best national anthem? Ooh, really? Because I've heard some good national anthems. I mean, the U.S. isn't in the running, but... No Aerojar Basura. What language is that? I will give it a listen. It's Spanish. Okay, I thought it might be. Okay, now I think we're probably just in like one of these Central American countries again. I'm going to go El Salvador until it's El Salvador. Apparently it was Paraguay. No, it was Argentina. It was Argentina, near Paraguay. That was just Argentina, really? Okay. Is this Brazil? What's this? Oh, wait. Am I seeing Cyrillic here, or am I just crazy? We have some points, yay! I can't quite make this out, but they that looks Muslim to me. Which is... but then that looks Cyrillic? I'm very confused. Um, and then we've got like South America poles. Could we be in Africa? This is a map of all photospheres and it covers pretty much every country. It's it's kind of a joke of like what GeoGuessr will be in 2069 because you have high quality photos and full coverage of the world. Wild guess Syria. I don't know about I mean is does Syria have palms? I I don't know much about Syria's foliage to be honest. Could it be Arabic? I don't think it's Arabic. I think it's Cyrillic. It's not Hebrew. I think it's a Stan. I think we're in a Stan. Um, how about Tajikistan? Oh, gosh, it was Nigeria. What? Nigeria. I thought that guy in the distance looked African, but nothing else looked African to me. 
What do I know? Um, okay. I think we're in Africa. Western coast? Cyrillic in Nigeria, clearly. Yeah, I must have misread it. What's that? Toilet? If French, okay, French, Africa. Are we in like Senegal or something? West, Western water. I'm going to go Senegal here. I'm going to go down here. Nice. I actually got close. That was, half, that was more than half our points <laughs> just from that one guess. All right. We're going to give this one more try. Um, nope. Okay. What's this? Solar panels? Hold on. Oh, I can't tell what that's doing. You couldn't have gotten the sign in view. Come on. How about these people? It reminds you of God Save the King with louder instruments. That's funny. Like, there's no cacti. Ooh, what's that? A gazebo? I feel like there's a city in the distance. I'm tempted to go, like, Middle East. But these trees are throwing me off a bit. Um... I don't know. Maybe we go like All right, two people say Iran. Uh Sure. Hey, look at that. We got the right country. I just realized we have to get 4K on every location in order to... So this is... Is this Russia? Seems like it. We have to get 4K in every location to get hit 20K. That's going to be really hard. Unfortunately, Russia, we can get like two points. I don't know how to region guess Russia. It's cold. Uh... Here. Darn it. Okay. Yeah, we're lucky Russia's small, huh? Oh my gosh. It's so flat. And what is this dirt? What causes that? That's so interesting. They like paved the the rocky ground. Going to seventh grade soon, may need to sharpen your geography. It's a salt flat. Okay. Interesting. Is there salt flats in Bolivia? Utah. How about this plate, though? That's a weird plate. The photographer is Ali Asghar Shafi. That does not look like it would be a Bolivia plate to me. It could be Arabic. It doesn't look a lot like Arabic to me, but it's so it's so blurry. Uh, how, what do I know? I thought that 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 Nigeria was Cyrillic. So, is there like a big salt flat in the Middle East? I asked first. I asked first. <laughs> Syria rings a bell. 
Nope, I ran. Oh well. At least I got the right region. We had this location, didn't we? Yes, we had this exact location. Oh no. Yeah, with the 1664, which was a beer. Shoot, where was this? Was this just Mexico? No. Hey, Zany. Catching the last few minutes of the stream. This flag, I remember... We spent a while on this one, and I don't remember where we guessed or what the answer was. Shoot, we need to start remembering these, because there's a lot of repeats. Was this on an island? You know, it might have been. Oh, this was uh, Bahamas, right? Sure, here's the flag. It's like a blue flag with a yellow diagonal stripe through it. Was it Bahamas? I see that human. I'm going to go Bahamas and then we'll try to remember where it actually was. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, it was... Oh yeah, we made that joke! Because I had guessed uh, Dominican Republic. Uh, I, no, I guessed Haiti, Port-au-Prince. And it was actually uh, in Congo, uh, Ponte Noir. Darn it. Maybe we'll remember next time. Next time it repeats. Is that even Congo's flag? I guess it's kind of reminiscent of Congo's flag. It's winter. Well, we, as we all know, only, um, what's it called? Only Bulgaria has winter, so we're going to go Bulgaria. Darn it, it was China. Who knew China had winter? All right. 5K. All right, we'll, we'll finish up with, uh, with one round of Community World. We tried. Getting 4K on every location is going to... It's going to take some memorization of locations, I think. Um, I think that we are in um, Lithuania. Nope. I think we're in Russia. Oh yeah, Bollard Spam. Nice. That's a weird G. Just a casual 4100 in Russia. Um, oh. I can move. Uh, where do I want to move to? Can I go down here? Ooh, I can. Stop signs on the right. Can I see this? It's not really paved. It's not really paved road. What? Johnny Hughes Road. Whoever that is. Mailbox. I think we're in the U.S. No front plate. Oh, maybe there's a. Uh, it's blurring where there ought to be a front plate. We do have a small black, small back plate there. Trampoline. Okay, I'm gonna guess like, I don't know, Tennessee. Mm, no, I'm gonna guess Alabama. Hey, not bad. It was Tennessee, darn. Wow. The Aussie flag. I 
can't tell like what that flag's doing. It's either New Zealand or Australia. We'll find out some other way. Sit down or take away food. Herald Sun. Weekly Times. Save the children. Whoa, Gen 1? I think New Zealand has some Gen 1, don't they? Ma K designs. There are some giveaways for New Zealand versus Australia, so I might as well look for it. This is like a cool little shopping place. Okay, here we go. C222 to Horsham, Halls Gap. Horsham. Does New Zealand have a Horsham? Do they name their road C222 or A A8, I suppose? Yeah. I I'm I'm leaning towards Australia at this point because who who labels their roads like that? Australia does. Um yeah. I got to find A here's A8. Or is that yeah, that's A8. And I need C222. Do you see Horsham anywhere? Oh, Horsham. So we're somewhere around here. We're not in Horsham, though. But which way is it pointing for Horsham? It's pointing north. Yeah, we're somewhere, we're somewhere around here. 4800 for Australia? Not bad. Photo with an F. Okay, so Spanish. Double yellow lines. Oh, do you think this is, do you think that wasn't Spanish? I think it's Portuguese. Yeah, this is Brazil for sure. Um, I can't read Jingus Brazil for my life. Yikes. I mean, that feels pretty close for Brazil, and it's still under 3k. Brazil's huge. <clears throat> oh, we got bars and mirrors. This is Guatemala, then? I think we did pretty good almost 21k considering we got an uh we got an australia a russia and a brazil getting 21k is pretty good all right that's going to be the stream thanks everybody thanks for hanging out hope you enjoyed yourselves i certainly did Thank you to my super supporters, The Asylum, Peter, David Ratner, Sotek, Franco, Mathke, Kenny, Woofer, and Rise to the Equation. Thank you to all my members and patrons. And uh, tomorrow's stream will be Sudoku stream, so uh, hope to see you there, and uh, have a great evening.